And good evening, Southeast Texas, tracking two systems. The first one, obviously, is Fred, and this is just hanging on. I'm very surprised the Hurricane Center did not uh, weaken this. Right now, it's got winds of 35 miles an hour, and it's being steered by high pressure, uh, subtropical high off towards its north. So it's going to continue moving west-northwest. Winds are at 35. Again, paralleling the northern coast of Cuba could strengthen as it heads towards Saturday morning. Tropical storm watches are in effect for South Florida and the Keys, and it could arrive there by Saturday afternoon. And then around the western periphery of the subtropical high will guide it on into the Florida panhandle uh, coming up Monday afternoon. Again, the western edge of that subtropical high, that's where it's going to follow right on into Florida. Otherwise, we continue to watch Invest 95L. It has a high probability of development in the next two to five days. Again, you could see heading towards the Leeward Islands and maybe over towards the Bahamas. Pretty close to what Fred's uh, track has been. Otherwise, as you can see, the consensus takes this maybe towards uh, Saturday, Sunday and towards the uh, Lesser Antilles. The middle line takes it over towards Hispaniola and maybe Cuba. But there is a potential it could track further to the north in the southwestern Atlantic. Many days to watch this. This is not going to be a, a short-lived item. Download our app. Follow us on Facebook and Twitter. And as always, there's more weather at 12newsnow.com.